Lou, as we look at these early swings, there was very little top arm extension. He always kind of jammed on it and had a real low 68 mile an hour uh, average. Decent enough stride, but look at that top arm. It doesn't extend. The hand path isn't great to the ball, but wherever your hand path goes, if the top arm doesn't extend and you just wrist it, you're going to end up with that. Uh, take a look there again. Top arm just is bent in impact. And you can see even on these here, it's just almost like you extend the arm so far, it stops here, look at it, and then you just kind of wrist it through. No consistency or, po or power with that. And we worked hard to try to create a better snap. Watch Robert Blyburn, watch how his top arm extends. That keeps the bat head going, literally forward within the rotation of the hips and it cuts and drives the ball. A little bit different style, but same technique as uh, Travis Clark. Watch how that top arm extension pushes that bad head around in the arc and levels it off in a linear manner. So we wanted to get a little bit better hip rotation on here. Watch your back foot initially here. Watch how it kind of drags sideways instead of making a complete turn. See it right there, your back foot. But otherwise, great weight transfer and rotation. We worked on creating a lag with the top arm in particular because we wanted to get that extended. That was great. And then using a down hand path, any ball that's below your shoulders, we're going to have to take the hand path to the ball, so we use a swing simulator. And then again, here's a lower pitch, take your hand path to the ball. Uh, great extension and drive through. Very nice, nice, nice improvement. Working on the perfect snap, we started working lag and then snap. See how your top hand doesn't come over there? Not a complete finish of it. So we worked on that and then over here, it looks considerably better. Nice straight. A to B swing on the perfect snap and your top arm is really extended to create that. Now we worked a lag, a short lag, and then cutting it through and snapping to the point of impact right there. And then off the tee, lag, lag, and then snap. This keeps us from uh, getting too far out ahead on the lag and having the knob come up in the air. Here your hand path comes down to the ball. Again, any pits that's below your, sh your shoulders, the hand path has to come down to the ball. There's good top arm extension, you cut through a pitch really nice, just fast amount of improvement. You're not a very big guy and you increase from 68 miles an hour to an average of 80 with a high of 89. Here on a low pitch you just absolutely kill that ball, proving you take your hand path, you can take a knee high pitch which we aren't advocates of swinging at, but you can certainly cut it and drive it well if you have to get stuck swinging at that. At the end here, the arm extension was vastly improved. Not 100%, but getting close to it. You had some balls 87 and 89 miles an hour. For a 57 year old guy who weighs 185, that's fabulous. It's a nice stretched out stride, good rotation. There, the arm extension and the hand path take you right to the middle of the ball. Good line drive with some underspin on it. Absolutely phenomenal. Uh, continue to work on the perfect snap, arm extension. Here you're swinging the um, Nautili. Did a great job with that bat. And uh, I think you hit three or four home runs along with the higher exit speed and you proved yourself you can pretty much aim at the middle of the top of the ball and uh, improve most fabulous. Keep going, you're going to have a fabulous year and great to have you in camp. Okay, good pitch, 84. Nice, nice shot, nice, that's fun. Look at there, you watch, watch that, that's going to be close to going on. You missed the bottom of that, but you had that 73. You missed the bottom of that, but it was a good level swing, you just missed the bottom. 87 again. 79. Drive it. Top hand. Look at that. Enjoy that. That's going out. Way out. Get the hands back. Get, get a lot of hip action. Reach your head. Drive the hips. Drive the hands. Off the taper, that still might go. Okay, four, stand over there, whole plate. Had a nice home run, one off the fence, Lou. What'd you do? Perfect snap. Uh, Tell the back camera so we can hear it. Level swing and, uh, and down. Rather than golfing it up. And a lot more arm extensions, what I saw. A lot faster. You kind of slowed it down. That's as fast as you can go, the arm extension. Nice job. What are the one or two keys that you really worked on that made sense for you? I think not trying to lift the ball. I think before I was trying to to, to swing up, and now I, I'm going to trust that a level swing is going to make that ball go up in the air rather than trying to lift the ball up into the air.
can't score on the field, you can't score off the field, you don't even know how to keep score. It's time to settle the score. Get yourself a 2019 Nautilite D Marini. What's in your bad bag?